right, hey there everyone. How you doing? Um, as you can see now, I'm on the ferry and I, uh, I did a kind of a Facebook live stream when I was boarding the ferry, which was quite interesting. And um, then I did another uh, little live stream of uh, standing out here when the ship was really pitching and rolling. And then I started to get seasick. And I think I thought I was going to barf. So I went back to my room and uh, had a little nap. And it's not so bad now, but uh, I managed to uh, eat my bento and still feeling a little bit wonky, but uh, not too bad. And as you can see in the background, uh, the, the horizon is still uh, rolling a little bit, uh, but it's not too bad. And my butt is getting real hot right now. So I'm gonna stand up and I'll just give you a little view of the ocean. So as you can see, this is the back of the ship or ferry. And I tried to go to the front. Gorgeous day. And really windy out here. And you can see the waves actually, the waves are pretty big, but the ship's not rolling too badly. It looks like. I'm going to go inside and continue, so uh, just give me a sec. Okay, so I made my way back onto the ferry, or inside the ferry, and um, to tell you the truth, I'm not really feeling well, still feeling a bit, a bit green. I did manage to eat a bento, uh, but, and uh, drink some uh, milk tea. but uh, not the happiest camper in the world right now. I'm just sitting in this little lounge uh, with some vending machines and uh, they're mostly drink vending machines. And there's a snack machine that sells hot foods like hamburgers, hot dogs, french fries, fried chicken, um, rice balls, and octopus balls. And I bet you didn't know octopus had balls. Stupid joke, but Anyways, um, now, if you get seasick, I don't recommend you taking a ferry uh, on a long journey uh, because, um, yeah, when you're nauseous, you, you can't do anything, really. Um, so if I were to do this again, I would definitely not take the ferry. I would have my vehicle shipped to uh, one of the mainland ports and fly to the nearest airport and just go pick my vehicle up. Now it would be a little bit more expensive, but what is the price 
of 25 hours of nauseous, nauseousness. Is that a word? I don't know. But anyways, you get the idea. So uh, I think I'm just going to go back to my room um, and uh, try to edit this video and uh, have a little nap. And I really, re one, one other thing is that I really respect sailors, people who work on the ocean, in the sea, uh, fishermen. People who work on cargo ships, uh, sailors, um, it's a hard, it would be hard. I guess you get used to it, but um, yeah, and I guess you wouldn't uh, do it if you got seasick all the time either. But anyways, we'll, uh, we'll see you again. Um, if you like my video, hit subscribe and give me a thumbs up and like and uh, I'll see you again I'd like you to once again wish you all the best good health good fortune and good luck this is Jake the Hen Nagaijin signing out see ya